Welcome to Star Citizen and an XXL guide for the CCU game browser add-on. Star Citizen, with its countless ships, the more than complex pledge store system, various item stores, extensive upgrade options, a separate store for concierge members, a complex buyback, as well as many other components, is anything but easy and clear to present. Until now. Because with Rishwa's new browser add-on CCU game, The Hangar Games, our hangar and store has never been easier and clearer. I'm a game changer. Even long-term veterans and professionals could so far only after a long search in the various areas and the manual sifting, new offers and upgrade options in the various stores. A rough overview, which on the one hand takes some time and on the other hand often the best offers and information had not revealed to all-star citizens and not to speak of a surge in the buyback system. I don't hide from the battle. Therefore, until now, one had to resort to extensive tables or external tools, which could facilitate the overview, but were also associated with work and manual editing. And before we start with an overview of this completely free browser add-on, as well as the details of the different sections, I would like to empathize that we are not involved in the development of the add-on, nor have we received any compensation or other benefits. So this is our uninfluenced and free opinion. The browser add-on, developed by the German programmer Rishwa, which is available for free for all major browsers, does not exchange any data with external sources or the developer. Only the connection from the add-on, which stores the data locally in your browser, to the pledge store is established. Also, we do not enter any data into the add-on, but log in as usual on robotspaceindustries.com with which the add-on prepares the data directly from the pledge store for us clearly. In addition, common data octopuses such as Google Analytics also do not access the data in our add-on. Short and simple explained, it is a clearer and sortable interface of your own pledge store. In the following, we will go through all functions and features step by step, where the enormous advantages and comfort functions become clear. And in the second part, we go into detail and take a look at some options that are not available in the Pledge Store. Welcome to the CCU game, play the Hangar games. After installing the add-on, we are first greeted with the terms of use and the changelog. Here it should be noted there were almost daily enhancements and improvements for the add-on. In the upper left corner, we are prompted to log in under our account on robotspaceindustries.com, clicking on the message we come directly to our login page, or as usual, can simply log in there, which only allows us synchronize with the add-on. Depending on the amount of data, our items, ships, game packages, as well as the size of the current pledge store, all offers and upgrades, a query of the data sometimes takes several seconds. On the left side we find the menu, where we find under our items, all our items, so everything that is in our personal hangar. From upgrades to our ships and packages, the complete buyback, all skins to subscriber items and special items that we were credited to our account during the Kickstarter campaign. So a comprehensive view and even event items that we can earn in-game are listed here. And for items that we can only look at more closely in the pledge store by opening it manually, which often includes other items, we can find all of them here in the overview again. Under the menu Item Store, we find all current offers of the pledge store, from the currently possible upgrades of the ships, all game packages, all currently available standalone ships, special packs, paints and armor, any FPS equipment, the complete subscriber store, should we have access to this, add-ons and all other areas, which often offer only temporarily content. And here we get it in a very clear and concise view, a sortable display of the respective insurance length for ships and packages, the possibility to also display and filter reduced warbond versions, of course with the respective savings calculated directly, a direct search and filter functions, as well as for packages, the respective information what is included in these packages. And with the calculation of the possible savings of individual items, we see very quickly whether it could be an interesting offer. And of course, we find also an indication whether it concerns special concierge offers, the respective item in our hangar still giveaways, as well as the appropriated values included. And to go back to the functionality of the add-on, 
The add-on offers, after your normal login on robotspaceindustries.com, the possibility to query your personal items and packages, depending on your own permissions in the flash drawer to reflect its current state, and these data based on the data available there, searchable and filterable display. And this is done without any advertising or intrusive requests for donations. Rather, you will receive regular updates and transparency to the add-on, after the data has stored locally with you. And because of this, the display results are also different for each user and their very personal data situation in the Pledge Store. With the last menu info, we find on there all ships, all so far published ships, vehicles and the respective variants again, whereby we access here with a simple click on the official information on robotspaceindustries.com. This gives us an overview of which ships and vehicles are available, whether they are in the concept phase or already flight ready in the game. And finally, there is a direct link to the Discord of the add-on, where you can ask questions, make suggestions or get information. The Citizen Spotlight entry, which of course should be supported, as well as an overview of our current store credits, the buyback tokens, a summary of all ship and upgrade purchases, where we can find the current price status as well as our paid pledges. We also get an overview of the differences here. So we get everything we need for what is probably the most expensive minigame in gaming history. So nothing stands in the way of the real money version of the Hunger Games. If you are looking for more detailed information on the individual areas, the second part of the guide is just right for you. Because here we go into detail about the functions, which offer even more possibilities. And to be able to really show all areas, we have used a somewhat more extensive and older game account for this. In the area of the upgrades, we have with different colorings as well as the possibility of the activation of our buyback, directly the overview which upgrades we have in our hangar currently, as well as in the buyback available. You can see the number of upgrades, the origin and the destination of the upgrade, any insurance included in the upgrade, the upgrade values, what we paid for the upgrade and how much we saved on the upgrade. For the upgrade available in the hangar, there is also the indication if we can still give away this upgrade. And in the buyback upgrades, the possibility to put this upgrade directly into our shopping cart. Of course, this is done in the background on robotspaceindustries.com. A payment and all further steps take place due to the add-on structure naturally exclusively over robotspaceindustries.com. And by using the filter function, we can do a full text search of all our upgrades, whether in the hangar or buyback. Especially for large buybacks with several hundreds or thousands of items, this feature is a huge time saver and a very powerful convenience feature. And especially in combination with a complete mirroring of the pledge store, we have the possibility, especially for events or promotions that come up with many reduced and special offers and upgrades, to get a quick and effective view, to customize and search our available upgrades and this to determine maximum savings and the best upgrade chains for our plans. Therefore, this section is beneficial not only for grey market traders, large corporations or star citizen enthusiasts, but for anyone who wants to maximize savings on the already very expensive pledge store purchase options. In the second menu item, the hangar, we have the option to view our entire current hangar, where we also get a comprehensive overview of the respective insurance lengths, the current selling price, our paid pledge prices, any savings, the purchase date, as well as any included game packages or the single-player expansion squad in 42 displayed. Last but not least, you can see the name of the ship, which is currently only available for a few ships.
And also here we have the possibility to click directly on the ship or the respective picture to get all information in the pledge store or on the Arizai website. Another comfort function is also the export of our fleet for the fleet view as JSON file or as CSV export. Here the download is done directly to our computer and of course we can edit the data. By means of the different data fields, we can also sort accordingly by insurance lengths, price ranges, savings or other variables, whereby larger packages with several ships are also displayed to us. Here we get the overview of the individual ships as well as the indication that they are packages. In addition, detailed information is available via tooltips. One of the main advantages of the CCU game add-on is, in our opinion, the overview of the complete buyback system, where we not only get the individual items displayed and can use the search, but can also directly put individual items in the shopping cart on the RSI page, which saves us a lengthy search there and as well a lot of time and nerves. And also special items like rare upgrade kits or conversion kits have been integrated directly into the add-on in the meantime after a feedback to the developer Irishwa. In the area of the skins, it is self-explanatory to a larger extent, whereby as here also indicated whether it concerns parts of a package, a giving away is possible as well as the full text search fills our purpose also here. Under the FPS equipment section, we get all the items we have in the hangar, about subscriber store purchases, special items that we awarded in the Kickstarter campaign, event items such as the latest in the game unlockable Invictus jacket, as well as all the basic functions, about a possible giveaway, as well as the filter function. Another special feature, and not to be underestimated, help is the mirroring of the complete pledge store after we get here also event offers displayed, which may be available only for a short time. Here are further improvements and expansions of the add-on plant, which can bring additional information than the special event marking. Because not only upgrades are clearly displayed, without us having to fight through the upgrade menu, but also all game packages, where again depending on the activation in the pledge store, that is, among other things, the ability to access advantage packages as a concierge member, all available packages are displayed with the corresponding content. And finally we come under extras everything else that is available for us in the pledge store. As a subscriber we have the complete subscriber store, of course all the special packages, skins and everything else hiding in the different sections of the store. By the way, we have the possibility to limit the refreshing of our data from the store to everything expect the buyback, since it doesn't change daily and therefore you need less traffic and also less time for a refresh. And with our all ships view we get another useful source of information about all ships and vehicles, their prices as well as the current production status. The CCU game, the Hangar Games add-on you get via the known add-on pages of the respective browsers. There you could install it as usual. Furthermore, the developer offers the latest updates and test versions for download via his Discord server. You can find the link in the video description. And since the add-on is completely free, without any advertising or data collection, it is natural for us to support at least the Citizen Spotlight entry because we have already saved a lot of time and nerves, and at the same time a pleasant and fast view of our hangar and of course the current offered. And of course you can find the link to the entry in the video description. 
And we would like to take this opportunity to thank Rishwa again for this great add-on. Thank you! I hope you liked the video and leave me a like and maybe even a subscribe here. With the CCU game, the Hangar Games add-on, we have a fast, effective and above all free and safe alternative to the Pledge Store without having to take any risks or pay with our data. It would be nice if CIG would take an example here and make some improvements of the existing systems. But as always, I'm interested in your opinions on the subject. What do you think about the add-on? Feel free to write me in the comments, in the Discord or in the two almost daily Twitch livestreams. And as always, the most important at the end, a big thank you to all Patreons, channel members and Twitch subscribers. Without you, this would not be possible in this form. You are a huge motivation. Thank you for your support. You guys definitely rock. And of course, there will be extensive giveaways again this month. How you can participate and what to expect, you can find out in the Discord or in the video description. I say goodbye until next time. See you soon. And as always, see you in the verse.